Hombali Films brings to you RCB 12th Man TV. A match against defending champions England was never going to be a cakewalk. What a masterclass by the Indian bowlers. Joss Butler's men all out for 129. India winning the match by 100 runs and soaring on top of the points table. Some crucial knocks and a couple of important spells that helped India win this game. Who was the standout performer according to you? Rohit Sharma. Rohit Sharma? Rohit Sharma. Rohit Sharma. For me, the standout performer was Rohit Sharma. It wasn't easy to bat on that pitch. There was a lot of movement for the fast bowlers. Spinners got a bit of purchase. And I think very few batters in the world can bridge aggression and patience in the way Rohit Sharma can. And that's just what he did today. Put away the bat balls, rotated strike well, kept one end up. Like, it's not easy when three of the top four are dismissed for single digits. It's obviously not easy to keep the run scoring going. And that's just what he did. Uh, I think performer of the match was Rohit Sharma because he was a game changer. Uh, the difference of the score is 100 and Rohit Sharma scored 87. So, uh, Rohit Sharma was the big difference. Yeah, to me, the Rohit Sharma, the, play, the game he played, when the match was tricky situation and I thought that we are not able to put up uh, around 200 to 20 it was a little bit difficult at that time but uh, Roy Sharma did pull it off Jaspreet Bumrah he was amazing uh, he sets the momentum for the Indian team from the right word go the first wicket was very crucial for us to set the momentum in was Malan getting him out and then the second one was like mind blowing we all get on our feet after Roots LBW so I would give all, all my five stars to Bumrah and again, boom, boom, Bumrah! Uh, for me, I think Shami's spell was very crucial. Uh, the way he has come into the team in the last two matches, taken nine wickets in two matches, that's insane. Like, that kind of performance is really incredible. And I think uh, he can end up as the highest wicket taker in the World Cup. Mohamed Shami was a top performer for me. As Mohamed Shami took four main wickets, he took two wickets back to back in the power play, which was, the, which was very important. First was of Ben Stokes. Ben Stokes is a fabulous player and Bairstow is also a fabulous player. They are the main top order or middle and middle order of England. When they got out, the match was settled and India has taken the hold of the match. We got to see some great batting, some really important partnerships, valuable runs being scored, at the same time, some terrific bowling. But which was the game-changing moment according to you? Uh, I'd have to say Kuldeep Yadav's dismissal of Joss Butler. I've seen the two face off before and in the IPL. It's often ended in Butler's favour. If you saw today, Butler was obviously playing a defensive shot on the back foot and getting the ball to turn that much. Probably the only ball of the game that turned that much. That was special. I think those were the two consecutive wickets on Boomra's over. I think that that was the turning moment for me and that sets the whole crowd roaring and we were sure like we are going to win from there. Um, for me, the main point was that the Kuldeep's uh, wicket for Josh Butler, the way he bowled that ball, that, that, that was a ripper. Oh, wow, I, I can remember that ball any time. I mean, wow, what a ball, what a spin. I mean, I guess the, it was around three degrees of spin there that was showing there. It was an amazing ball, I guess. That was a turning point for me because he was just Butler was the captain. And if he was there, even in 10 overs, he could cover up all the runs. I think one of the best moments of the game for me was Shami's wicket of Ben Stokes because that really set us up for a big, big, big victory. And uh, that uh, crippled the English batting. So after that, we were able to win by a huge margin. The game-changing moment for me was when the Jaspreet Bumrah took back-to-back -back wickets. First wicket, it was okay. When the second wicket, when Root got out on Golden Duck after Milan, it was just amazing. I think the wicket of Ben Stokes, which Shami, take, uh, Shami took, uh, uh, five or six balls he uh, bowls offside and then uh, into the stumps was really good. What a day for Indian cricket fans to celebrate a 100-run victory against defending champions England. A short turnaround time for India's next assignment versus Sri Lanka in Mumbai on the 2nd of November. A chance for India to make it 7 out of 7 in this 2023 World Cup campaign.